What's up, you guys? Today we're cooking Wagyu tomahawk steaks. I'm here with Chebo. You may have seen on? him on TikTok before. He's a brilliant chef, and we're also here with Beto, and we're literally gonna be cooking this Wagyu steak on an outside fire pit, bushcraft style. So, without any further ado, let's get this fire pumping, let's chop up some wood, and let's get some Wagyu. Let's, let's do it. So this is a Aussie Wagyu tomahawk, marble score eight to nine. The best you can go for Aussie Wagyu is nine plus, and Aussie is second to Japanese. Oh my God, it looks beautiful. Yeah, the marbling's insane. Right. I feel like I need some protective goggles or some. Bro, you miss, just break my tongue. <laughs> <I know. laughs> you better not miss, bro. You wanna line up so it splits? Not bad. That wasn't, that wasn't good. <laughs> <laughs> nice. nice! And you gotta suck in there. Yeah, now oh, it's just right, this little drop into place. Hey, hey, not bad, you know? It's split. Not bad for your first time. job. Let's see you do it, mate. Right. Tr trust exercise. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Hey. That's a little bit moldy. No, it's not, bro. This. Bro, don't look. Get that off camera. We're get about that. to cook you Wagyu you. on this, bro. Bro, bro get, that off, get that off camera, bro. Get, get out of here. Get Welcome to Wood Chop 101. I'm about to show you how to cut some wood country boy style. Yee! Dog it! Hey, how's it going? Like a damn pro. Let's see how, uh, how dirty this thing actually was. Can you not pull out my fire pit, bro? <laughs> bro, the fire pit you probably never even used. I haven't used it. <laughs> Alright. Oh, my. So it's grey under there. It was grey. <laughs> you think I'm gonna hold it? Yeah. Okay, well, that's a uh, good is new. Yeah, that is new, but it was new 50 years ago. <laughs> Pyramid. I want the firewood to go out of the screen. That's how big we're gonna make it. This fire is gonna be huge. It's gonna burn Beto's house. <laughs> Let's hope not. Come on, boys. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna use my house here. <laughs> so the only time I've ever had wagyu was in ground beef, like r wagyu ground that beef. Doesn't even count. That's what I'm saying. So this is gonna be a first for me, and to have it like this is a treat, especially by Chebo himself. So let's light this bitch up. Oh god, it's white. Right in sunscreen, <laughs> put it on. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we're going big with this fire. I should step back. <laughs> is, is it gonna explode, bro? <laughs> nah, <laughs> it should be good. It's just gonna like slowly engulf it. But once it's up, it's up. You know my friend, yeah. friends stick together to the end. Then you go and stab me in the back and then pretend that Star, Sing the campfire song C-A-M-P-F-I-R-E-S-O-N-G -E song <laughs> Looking good so far Now we wait till it's a bed of coals And then we go caveman style <laughs> Fire! Fire! Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> this is my $500 Japanese knife yeah. Take this in $500 for a knife. This guy means business. And that's like entry range. Really? They get ridiculous. So this one's like smooth like butter, huh? Pretty much, yeah. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Stay away from me with that knife. So this thing, if you were to eat it at a restaurant, all up, it'd be like 200 bucks. Oh, sorry, $2,000. 2000 Yeah. I, I get discounts because I'm, you know, got the hookup, but you've got four tomahawks here. One, two, three, four. And then you want to split them down the middle. So you get nice even cuts. My knife. Oh my god, I like butter. It is very fun to use. It doesn't fall off the table. You ready to catch it? Yep. Oh, oh my god, god. let's go in. Jeez. That, that is some it. real wagyu. That's incredible. They're not putting that in your burger, bro. No, no way. Chance. That doesn't look anything like the wagyu ground beef I had. I know you guys are having mouth watering behind the screen right now. It's gonna taste so good. Dude, I'm ready. That's, that could feed someone for days though. So our once big fire has now turned to just a little flame. It's Will Chebo be able to save it? We'll find out. These are brand new. I bought them for the fire pit. Wow. A year ago. <laughs> How many Aussies does it take to start a fire? 
Let's find out. We're letting our country down. <laughs> and, and now, now we season. season. Salt, garlic, charcoal rub, and paprika. You've been a naughty girl, haven't you? Yeah. You're a dirty bitch. My girlfriend's looking at me in the window with a knife. <laughs> <laughs> Check out the ingenuity of this. Made with a PVC pipe. When the fire ain't burning hard enough, let's blow this bitch. So now it's time to break this down to charcoal. Um, I'm gonna stay back for this, so watch Chebo. Safety first, everyone. Why you not my friend? Yeah. Cause friends love each other when they can. But you let me down, never thought of me again. Triple gloving, triple loving. We bit hot. <laughs> <laughs> so we threw them in the oven for just a couple minutes to get the inside cooked a little bit. And now we're about to throw it on the fire. And now we put them on the fire. Oh, fuck. Okay. Yeah. Now this, caveman style. I'm gonna flip them pretty often. I mean, also. Nice. They're by the inside. <clears throat> there you go. Nice, we're done. Give it. Man, that smells good. Yeah. All right, so we've wrapped it in foil, and this is what's called the rest phase. So the rest phase is when we let the meat settle after cooking, so that all the heat from the outside can travel inward and cook it consistently. If we cut into it now, we're gonna have a nice charred outside, but like pink raw bloody inside. You also need to rest it because all of the juices inside are all over the place. So resting it in the foil allows them to settle. So when you cut through, you're getting a nice juicy bite. Let's cook a Wagyu tomahawk, caveman style. Mm. Wow, that's freaking delicious, man. Nice. Look at that. Let me, let me check the insides. It's pretty good. That's I'll tell rare. you, it's pretty good. Man, I barely have to chew that. I can just swallow it. Wagyu. Woo! That is delicious. Pass here, bye. Pass here, bye. Come over here. Come over here. Come over here. Mmm. Oh. Oh yeah. Mmm. That's gone. Mm. I'm going for one more. Mmm. Oh my god. You don't even need butter or anything when you're cooking this on fire. Those natural juices. You hear that? That's not saliva. That's tomahawk wagyu juice, baby. And he's Woo! got all that wagyu fat fucking mm. dripping down him. Oh, Take fuck. Come on. Give it some. Oh my god. <laughs> that's incredible. Try to tender. Man, that's fantastic. You outdid yourself there, my we man. We forgot one thing. The salt. Oh, the salts. It honestly didn't even need it. You know what? It'll be better with S it. Salt bay it. I'll do the honors. Do the honors, my man. Oh. Wow. Oh. Oh. Wow. Oh, I know y'all want to take a bite, so here. Mm. Look at that knife skills. So this one tends to get a bit more overdone because it's a smaller muscle. If you see that. It is beautiful. 10 out of 10. Oops. Would you care to do the honors? I would love to. Cheers. Oh my god. Man. See how soft it is? I got butter. Mm. That's the best thing I've ever eaten in my life. You hear all that juice in my mouth? That's incredible. It's probably my favorite cut of steak. Man, you really outdid yourself. Thank this you. is outstanding. It literally just turns to like juice. You can see in your the mouth. muscle fibers, how tender it is. 
Man, can you come back to LA with me? Personal chef? Yes, please. Might be arranged. <laughs> Let's try this. Alrighty. Wow. It's so tender. It melts in your mouth. It's like bread. <laughs> this is bread. gone. This is gone. <laughs> bread. <laughs> this is gone. I've never heard that comparison before. <laughs> Wow, that's amazing. Mm. That is so good. I've got a restaurant and pay over 200 bucks for this, but... Easy 200. But this is way better. So there you have it. Caveman Wagyu Tomahawks. Cooked by the legend himself, Chebo. You guys gotta go check him out. His link will be down below, man. These are amazing. If you enjoyed this video, smash the thumbs up. Hit the subscribe. Pick up the merch brand Taylor.com. And until next time, we'll see you guys later. Peace. Thank you. Mmm. Mmm. You're so good. <laughs> <laughs> You're not my friend, yeah. Cause friends stick together to the end. Then you go and stab me in the back and then pretend that I'm the bad guy. Then you ask why.